To perform a spider plank, start in a plank position, then bring one knee towards the same elbow, alternating sides. This move strengthens the core, improves balance, and targets the obliques, shoulders, and hip flexors, enhancing overall stability and coordination. To do a plank shoulder tap, start in a plank position, tap your left shoulder with your right hand, then tap your right shoulder with your left hand. This improves core stability, strengthens shoulders, and engages obliques, promoting better posture and reducing the risk of lower back pain. To perform a front plank toe tap, start in a plank position, then alternate tapping each foot out to the side. This exercise strengthens the core, improves balance, targets the obliques, and enhances overall stability and coordination. To perform a side plank leg lift, start in a side plank position, lift your top leg while keeping your core engaged, then lower it back down. This exercise strengthens the core, obliques, hips, and improves balance and stability. To do a kneeling plank, start on your hands and knees, aligning wrists under shoulders. Extend legs back, keeping hips in line with shoulders and knees. Engage core and hold for 20 to 30 seconds. Benefits include core strengthening, improved posture, and reduced lower back pain. To perform a plank lateral raise, start in a plank position, then lift one arm out to the side, keeping it straight. Return to plank and repeat on the other side. This exercise strengthens the shoulders, core, and stabilizing muscles, improving overall upper body and core strength. I've got 